Hi everyone and welcome to my channel. My name is Amanda and I'm from AmandaCrochets.com and in today's video I'm going to show you all of the new Karen Cake yarn that has come out for spring of 2021 and these yarns are exclusive to Michael stores and they came out a few weeks ago however even though they were on the website you weren't able to purchase them off the website they were only available in store only Unfortunately, my local Michaels did not have them in stock, so I had to wait a little while. And I would say maybe last week they were just finally available to purchase online. So I definitely stocked up on all of the new colors, or at least most of them. And there is one of the Karen Cotton Cakes, or Karen Cake Yarns, that were not available online. Still, as of right now, I believe. And so I just ended up going into my Michael store and they finally had some of the colors. So let's jump right in. So for this first Karen Cake yarn, it's called Karen Cotton Angel Cakes. And to me it's very similar to their regular Karen Cake yarns, the cotton ones. Um, it has a very similar feel to it. The only difference is I feel like it's more of like a... I don't know what you would call it, like a whitewashed. There's like... You have your main color, which in this case it's blue, and then you have a little bit of like lighter white or lighter blue in the cake itself. So I feel like it's very similar in feel and everything, so it's kind of like the same thing, I guess, if you want to call it that. And this is part of their Karen Cake Soft Summer Stripes collection. And they inc started including the price of the cakes on the yarn, as well as a limited time only. So I'm not sure if they're going to continue doing this in the future, but I did notice that that was new for the yarn label. So the yarn itself is a number four worsted weight yarn. They recommend a US 7 or 4.5 millimeter knitting needle. And they recommend a US H8 or 5mm crochet hook. It is machine washable and dryable. It's 60% cotton and 40% acry acrylic. It's 8.8 .8 ounces or 250 grams. 530 yards or 485 meters. And then this color is called Faded Jeans. And it's that really pretty light blue color with a few other blue shades mixed in. And I thought it was just a really pretty yarn. This next one is a light green color. And this one is called Summer Sage. And I really like this one as well. And you can definitely make a scarf with this or a baby blanket or a cowl. It's very soft and I feel like it's a very durable yarn. So... And it's really nice that it's a cotton blend and that you can just put it in the washing machine as well. So definitely recommend using this yarn. And then the next color I got was this one right here. And this is called Sea Salt. And it's kind of like a creamy color with a little bit of... Sorry about my hair. A little bit of... Um, kind of like a creamy taupe color so I thought that was really pretty for like more of a neutral palette. This next one that I got is this really pretty purple and this is called Heather and I really like that a lot as well. I don't usually pick up purple yarns for whatever reason but I just thought this was really pretty so I wanted to pick that up. And the final color that I got in this line is pepper and this is just a gray color I always like grays I feel like it's a very nice neutral color so I definitely wanted to pick this up and as you can see there's different shades of gray from medium to a light gray in this so the next line of Karen cakes that I picked up was the cotton ripple cakes and this was the yarn that was available online but you couldn't purchase online you can only purchase it in store. Now, I don't know if that has changed, but I ended up buying all of this in my local Michael's store instead. Again, they show the price and they show the limited time only. 
And like I, I forgot to mention with the other cakes, but you get a pattern on the label, which is very nice, and it shows you the how many skeins you need and the hook size, or if it's a knitting project, they'll show you the recommended knitting needle. And then the pattern is on the opposite side of this label. So I thought this was a very pretty scarf or cowl. And then if you wanted to look over here, they have another crochet project, and this is a crochet top. And again, the, lab the pattern is on the opposite side of the label. So for the Karen Ripple, the Karen Cotton Ripple Cakes, this comes in their Soft Summer Stripes collection as well. This one is 100% cotton. It's 8.5 ounces or 240 grams. It's 491 yards or 449 meters. This one is considered a lightweight yarn, a number three. They recommend a US 6 or 4 millimeter knitting needle or a G6 or 4 millimeter crochet hook. And again, this is machine washable and dryable. And with this, I feel like it's kind of different than I've seen before. I feel like the ripple effect is kind of different. Like, I just don't know how to describe it. Let's see if I can find an end of one of these yarns for you. Um... But I don't know if you can see, but it kind of gets its name from the ripple of the the strand of yarn. Again, I don't. I hope you can see that. But I really like the color and how it kind of fades like this. And this is the only striping one that I got. the They come in solid colors, and they also come in a couple of variegated colors like this. This is the only variegated color that was available at my Michaels store and this one is called Summer Rain and it has different shades of blue and looks like a little bit of green mixed in, a teal, and then it has that whole white around it. So I thought this was a really pretty color. And as far as the softness of it, I feel like it's pretty soft. I would say it's similar to the Cotton Angel Cakes where it's, it's soft but it could be a lot softer. It's definitely something that you can still make a, a blanket out of or a, a crochet top or something like that, a scarf. You could definitely wear something made with this yarn. Um, so it is still very soft, so just keep that in mind. The next color that I picked up was this really pretty blue color. And this color is called Breezy Blue. And it's a very pretty light blue color. Perfect for a baby boy if you were to make something with this, like a baby blanket. This next color is called Clear View, and it's kind of like a aqua blue color. Still very pretty. Next Karen Cotton Ripple Cake that I got was this color, and this is called Plum Fade. And again, it's kind of like a purpley color, like a lavender. And I don't really pick up these colors, but for whatever reason, this was calling my name, so I knew I had to pick this up. So this is Plum Fade. And finally, I picked up Blush. And this is kind of like a pinky coral color. I love this color. It's probably, I would say next to this Clear View color. This one is my next favorite. So this is clear view. This is blush. Just very, very pretty colors. Now finally, the yarn that I picked up that I was most excited for was the Karen Baby Cakes. I absolutely love this yarn. It's one of my favorites in the Karen Cake collection. The Baby Cakes yarn is definitely much bigger than they had in the past. In the past I had much smaller skeins, so I'm really happy that they came out with a bigger version of the Karen Baby Cakes. Again, they have the price on the label. This one says no wool, which is great because for babies you want to make sure that the items you're making 
are extra soft for their skin and this is again limited time only and again they have a pattern on the side which again is another crochet pattern this is a tumbling blocks blanket so it looks to be about a corner to corner stitch um, you need four balls of the Karen baby cake to make this pattern and again the pattern is on the opposite side of this label so this is the Karen baby cakes it is super super soft I really really like this yarn and they came out with a great selection of colors again this is part of the Karen cake summer the soft summer stripes collection and this is 8.5 ounces or 240 grams it's 560 yards or 512 meters it is 82% acrylic and 18% nylon this is machine washable and dryable like the other yarns I showed you this one is considered a number four worsted weight yarn and they recommend a US 8 5mm knitting needle and a US H8 5mm crochet hook for this yarn and this color is called Icy Aqua and I really like this a lot I think it's absolutely beautiful I cannot wait to start making some baby blankets using this baby blanket or this baby cake yarn so this is Icy Aqua the next color that I got is called aqua so they have two different colors of the aquas so this is more of a deeper shade I guess and this is a lighter shade so between the two aquas this is the difference of them so again this one's a little bit more brighter and then this is a little bit more of a light version and the next color that I got was this pink color right here and this is called Pink Lemonade. I thought that was a fun name. And again, it's very pretty light pink color. And it would be perfect for a baby girl blanket or anybody that loves pink, such as me. It's a very pretty color. The next color I picked up in the Baby Cake line is white. I don't think this is really white to me. This is more of a cream. So I think they should have labeled this as cream because my background is white and this is cream and it does not match. So definitely more of an off-white or cream color. So just be aware that when you pick this up, it's not a true white color. Still very pretty, but just not a true white color. And the last solid color that I got was Gray Owl. And this kind of looks like a taupey brownish gray color. I don't know if you would describe it that way as well, but to me it's kind of like a taupey gray color. So it's a very pretty neutral color that would probably match a lot of different baby nurseries or just work for anybody that has a neutral palette for their house and home decor. So Baby Cakes also has some striping or variegated colors and for the solid colors you can actually mix up and mix and match some of the solid colors so they would match up with the variegated colors. So this is the first one I got. It has different shades of taupe, an off-white, light blue, and a darker blue. And this one is called Sky Gazing. And for the difference of the solid and the variegated, the skeins are the same amount of ounces and yards. So you don't have to worry about having less yardage in your striped yarn. I know a lot of yarn companies have where the solid colors have a lot more yards than the variegated colors or the striped colors, but it's not the case in any of the Karen lines you get the same amount of yardage whether it's a solid color or a variegated color. So again this is scar uh, sky gazing. This next one is a little bit out of my comfort zone but again I was drawn to this because of the pinks and the purples and this one is called petals. I thought this would make a really pretty baby girl blanket and it has 
a light purple, kind of like a darker purple, a light peach color, and a light pink color. And I thought those colors were really pretty together. And this next one is kind of like a rainbow color, but a brighter rainbow. And this one is called Retro, and it has like a light pink, I'm not sure what you would call this, orangey, like an orangey color. So an orange, pink, light blue, and a medium blue, and then that bright yellow. So I thought this was really pretty. This is probably one of my favorites. And then last but not least, my absolute favorite color is this one right here of their Baby Cakes line. And this one is called Candy Hearts. I absolutely love the pastel rainbow that is included in this and I'm super excited to start something with this. So, candy hearts. So like I mentioned, they come with some striping and some solids. So if I wanted to match this up, this would pretty much be the yarn that I would use. It's an exact match, I feel like. I also feel like I can use this color and it will look very pretty with this as well. And if I wanted to use this one, I could probably use, this is not an exact match, but you could probably use those two colors together and still make something very pretty. And then again for this color, you can probably do this. I don't know if it's an exact match, but again, it will look very pretty. And you could probably also pair that with this color. And for this last color right here, star, uh, Sky Gazing, you can probably pair it with this color. That's almost an exact match. And you can pair it with that off-white. Again, it, this one's a little bit more not exact, which is why you can see how this cream color, what they call white, is not really white. So I definitely think Gray Owl will look very pretty with this. And maybe you could add this one as well. This one's not an exact match, but again, you can use your judgment and mix and match how you choose. It's totally up to you. So thank you so much for joining me today in learning about the new Karen Cake yarns that have come out for the spring of 2021. Have you picked up any of these yarns? Have you considered a favorite of any of these yarns? Again, my favorite is probably the Baby Cakes line. I really like that a lot. But I'm very excited to try the new Cotton Ripple Cakes as well as the Angel Cakes yarn. So let me know if you picked up any of these colors, what colors were your favorite. And please like, comment, and subscribe to see all future videos by me. And thanks so much for joining me today and have a great day. Bye!